Welcome to the Great Clouds tutorial on multiple attempts at passcode entry on the iPhone. Today we'll be using the iPhone 2G. Now, as many of you know, when you enter your passcode into an iPhone multiple times, it'll set up time intervals when you can actually enter the passcode in, in again. Uh, well, I found a way to bypass that by actually changing the name on the iPhone through iTunes. So today I'll demonstrate on how you can do so. So we'll make an attempt to try the passcode more than once. That's wrong. Second attempt is wrong. Third attempt is wrong. Fourth attempt is wrong. Fifth attempt is wrong. Final attempt disables the iPhone and asks you to try it, try it again in one minute. So what I have found is, if you actually go in the iTunes, let's see here, bring my cursor over to my iPhone. Let's see here, it's taking us time. And let's change the name www go back down to the iPhone as you can see once we let that set the iPhone should sync now usually this process is a bit quicker Waiting for that sync to take place. All right. So after the sync's taken place, you can actually go back into the iPhone again, and you won't have the time interval on there stating when you can try the passcode again. And you can do this multiple times until you uh, hopefully get your password entered. And you won't have to wait one, three, five, however minutes. I believe it goes up to uh, past six hours. You can keep trying it. Uh, but you can keep trying this. Uh, so basically all you do is just go onto the phone and uh, pretty much change the name. Uh, oh. Uh, please like the video or subscribe. Uh, thank you for watching and stay tuned for more videos from Gray Clouds. Thanks.